Hey everyone, a lot of you have been asking me for a makeup tutorial about how I did the Braveheart makeup for my last video and so I thought why not let's do this. Let's do a makeup tutorial on the best freedom makeup ever. We're going to go with a royal blue for the base and then we're going to go with this teal blue and this shade is kind of like if you took all the leftist tears that were cried and shed over the 2016 Donald Trump presidential election and then you boil them down into kind of like a sad little syrup and then made them into face paint that would be this shade and this is going to go on top of the deep blue and we're going to draw a dividing line down the center of our face think of our country being divided politically that's what you kind of want to do to your face and you want to apply it liberally all the way down and by liberally, I don't mean like crying and avoiding logic liberally. I mean like a lot. You want to apply it a lot all over the place. So just go to town. Get it into all the little wrinkles around your eyes that we get from laughing at the women's feminazi signs that we see at women's marches. Just get it in there. Liberal tier blue. And we're going to go mainstream media on this, which is a makeup term for cover it all up with a bunch of and just really lay it on thick. Kind of do the fish lip thing. We all can't have the natural American Indian cheekbones of Elizabeth Warren, so sometimes you gotta create it yourself, you know? And if you want, you can also add to the look by doing a little crazy hair and what you want to do is you just want to make it look like you're working your way through the judicial system like Kamala Harris just get in there get her done do what you got to do even if it's messy to get what you want and then I like to add what I call a little CNN just pop that baby in there looks real but it's not move on this side too well msnbc boom okay so you can always do a little alexandria ocasio cortez which is basically just doing crazy eyes like for battle battle ready crazy eyes and then you got to do a fake accent so braveheart is scottish so we'll do a little uh you don't get dressed up for nothing you got to go pick a fight for freedom. Last but not least, if you want to add a little extra, go over the top with your look. You can kind of spray fake blood on your face. Uh, be careful not to get it in your clothes because it does stain. If you do get blood or any bodily fluids on your clothes, there's a great website. I'll put the link below and basically the website has recipes for how to get the stains out, cover them up, all that stuff. Well, thanks guys. Uh, this is Good Patriot. I hope you enjoyed my makeup tutorial on Braveheart Freedom Makeup. And we will see you soon. Thanks.